So I have a series called Can I Profit Off of Certain Items? And I told myself my favorite topper is a Halo. So I was wondering, could I profit off a Halo set? And it should be easy, right? Look, I'm going around asking people at the end of the match what their favorite topper is, and the majority of people are telling me it's a Halo. Besides this guy, he told me nothing, but it is Halo. So I thought to myself, hey, it, they're easy to buy, they're cheap, it should be easy to profit off a Halo set. We'll find out. Hey, what is up YouTube? This is Redcard200. So we finally hit 1,000 subscribers. I'm very appreciative. Thank y'all. Thank the good Lord as well. And I'm giving away a massive giveaway, guys. Okay, over 35 items to over 17 people or 17 to be exact and um, it's worth about 8,000 credits in total of all the merchandise I'm going to go ahead and give out so I have some people have asked me when's the giveaway how do I enter more information to come May 23rd so please look out for that I'm a little shocked though that some of y'all have not asked me about the secret message there's a secret message in the trailer guys and my discord if you haven't if you haven't done so already join my discord they've actually got a head start to that they're they're on their way trying to figure that out so if they beat you to it hey so i tell you join my discord there's reasons for it join my community too there's reasons for it so uh, i'm letting y'all be aware there is a secret message there are two rewards if you figure out the secret message please don't do it on the discord because that ruins the fun out of everything message me on psn if you figured out the message on on the video but more information to come about that, okay? Ooh, no, 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 I'm sorry. You shouldn't have seen that, guys, okay? You shouldn't have seen that. I don't know why I'm showing that. But <laughs> there's a reason for it, obviously. But uh, welcome to the channel. If you are new, make sure you subscribe. What I'm doing here on this episode is I gather items, a set of items, and I basically see if I can make profit off of it. Our item today is a Halo set. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the trades and I'm going to show you how much it costs in order to gather the Halo set and then you basically make the the, the deal if you would want to do this as well to make profit. I'll let you know my discoveries. Should be easy, right? Hmm. We'll find out. Let's go to our trading. So if you're new to Rock League and want to make some sort of profit, Halo's a really good investment. I talk about it in my trade talk. Episode 6 or 7, one of those, I'm not too sure. But we're going to start off with our Burnt Sienna one. I got it during the cr the Chromalone uh, set episode. I paid 80 altogether, so I bought that Burnt Sienna for 20 credits. Let me tell you something. You never want to sell your Halos for less than 50. They at least give you 50 if you're patient enough. That is the big mistake that I see nowadays with people. They have no patience. Just wait. Maybe if you're quick selling, I guess maybe because of the item shop, but it's good just to wait. So right now we're at $90, I'm sorry, 90 credits in debt. I'm thinking of real cash here. So purple, sky blue, red, titanium white, black, those are the more expensive halos. Uh, I'm happy I got this one for 50. I was very shocked. Okay. But hey, I guess it was quick selling. Okay, uh, got a forest green one. For 50 credits, 50 like it, like I'm telling you, 50 credits is a good, it's a good uh, price to set your halos at. Uh, for 50, I'm surprised this blue is not more expensive. I like this blue. The sky blue is more expensive. That's like a one 150. But this blue is just 50. I would think it'd be a little bit more expensive. So this one I actually feel kind of bad about. Okay, my friend Wildcat. Uh, we give each other things, he gives me stuff, I give him stuff, that's kind of the, a relationship that we go with, and it's nice to have a friend where you do, you don't have to worry about getting scammed with, you know, like you give him stuff, he gives you stuff, and these Apex wheels, he gave them to me, so I apologize, I don't like to do that, but this guy w was desperate for Apex wheels, okay, and he offered me the trimmer wheels, the new ones, for just pretty much one-on-one -on -one trade, so I had to take it, I'm sorry, I, ha I had to take it. We'll talk about those terminal wheels maybe in another trade talk video, okay? But uh, we got the pink one. Uh, got it for 40, really, really cheap. Uh, now we got we, we're going to the more expensive ones, okay? We got this black one. Typically, it goes for 150. This is for some reason is my favorite Halo. It is black. That's the one I used to wreck a lot. I believe another friend gave me a black one in the very beginning. I still have that one, and I kind of stick with it. Now we're going with red, 130. Minimum is 150 for red, I believe. 
or 100 to 150 I got it for 130 at this point since I have a lot of halos I'm kind of just trying to gather them all like I'm just like okay I'll just pay bare minimum for it oh, we got the titanium white one the more expensive one for 220 no one wanted to do less than 200 I recently bought one for 100 okay so I'm not you know I was happy about that one but 220 for this one and then we got our last halo for the set at 100 let's see what our grand total is so the full set cost me 900 credits altogether when I added up all the all the calculations of each halo and I tell myself 900 that's more than I thought it cost really just kind of going through it 40 50 and it added up to quite a bit so 900 credits so to start us off we're gonna try to sell this at 1400 okay 1400 credits and see if anyone will basically take it and this is your time to basically say hey man Halo set's actually really nice everybody likes it it should be easy right hmm kind of wrong okay let me explain so what I've encountered I I had a harder time trying to sell this set and I told myself but why everybody loves the halo why am I having some trouble selling this set altogether well let me let me explain I encountered because I encountered a couple people telling me that for one the everybody likes halo so everybody has some of them and because everybody has some of them they only want certain colors because of that they don't want the whole set they only want certain colors so that was something I discovered I had some people wanting to split up my set I, I to get to get a certain color for their set I'm just like uh, I know and it's it's hilarious some guy offered me 150 for a pink one or 100 for a pink one he's like that's the last one I need for my set and I was like well what about my set you know you're gonna disband my set so at first 1400 didn't have a buyer okay everybody's trying to sell that 15 I'm selling at 14 so I went down to 13 and then if we think about it they're actually 13 halos so we're paying a hundred per halo and some people had a problem with that because they were like the burnt sienna I'm not gonna pay a hundred for burnt sienna uh, you know and I go well what about titanium white titanium white's 200 about 250 you're paying a hundred for it so we kind of see it like that so this guy's new to Rocket League he went ahead and said okay I'll give you 1200 for the set and I was like okay you know I'm not a museum I'm not here to collect items collect cars so I took that I go okay 1200 that is how much I made off of the halo set so that means I made a profit of 300 credits okay so will I encourage you to make the same investment as I did I believe so because you could find the halos at a cheaper price than I did it took me about two weeks to sell um, I could have probably made 1300 if I would have waited but I decided to just, you know, for obviously for the video, for the sake of the video, you could probably make a little bit more. So do I encourage you to do the same investment I did? Yeah, I really do. Because I think it, you probably make 400 350 and I think that's a decent amount uh, in order to, to make an investment of your time. So with those 300 credits, I went ahead and purchased you a red standard. I've actually been playing with the red standard since I got one recently. The black one, that one is really overrated. I'm not sure why they like the black one, but the red one, that one is a nice looking boost. So this person was selling it at 350 and I said, hey, I put in the extra 50 and I'm gonna hook y'all up with a red standard. This is what you have to do. This is the, the giveaway directions. At 5, 5 a.m. Central Time, on May 23rd which is a Saturday you have to text me boost just text me boost on PSN the first person that texts me boost on PSN will receive the crimson standard okay? that's all you gotta do a tip only text me one time don't text me twice because then you're gonna fall down the ladder don't even text me if you're disqualified don't do any of that okay just basically just text me okay test text me boost at remember five a.m. Central Time. Hey, the first person that does that will go ahead and get the, the boost on that day. Make sure you are there in order to claim your item. Okay. I appreciate y'all watching to the very end. Uh, thanks for watching and God bless you guys.